uh, always on email and always putting out fires of the business owner, as you can imagine. But we definitely try to focus on, as a family unit, how to how to just kind of manage our lives. How, how many workers you have? Uh, we have we're five total right now. Five total. That's not a lot. That's not much. Yeah, we're still a small business. Um, um, I think we, we're going to probably hire two more people with this next race. Interesting. If you, we're uh, very lean. Yeah, very lean. Absolutely. That's the way to go. If you have a huge billboard in the city, in New York, you know, uh, what message would you put on it beside your business name, of course? Of course. I think that the message is really just be a good person. Because in this in this crazy life and in this crazy world, um, I've just come across a lot of people that are just not really nice. <laughs> yeah. You know, no matter how much money they have, they're, they're, it's just not very nice people. And I always try to help along the way, whether it's connecting people, whether it's giving knowledge or, you know, I have two girlfriends that I met with the other day at lunch and they're starting a little business and, and I'm helping them with everything how to do it right, starting from day one, and 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 they should learn from my mistakes and and just be a good person. What do you mean by being a good person? I think um, being a good person is. That I know I know I've met so many people that could have helped me along the way, and they decided not to. Um, given helping me with their knowledge, and decided not to. That's what I mean by that. So generous. Open to share, open to exactly. help other people. Be generous with your time. Be generous with your knowledge. Just be generous. It doesn't have to be monetarily. So at this point in your career, it seems that you've been very successful before this uh, experience with the, with the Lux Beauty Club. In, in all these years, what is the best lesson that you have learned so far? The best lesson I have learned so far would probably be to ask a lot of questions. Ask a lot of questions in everything that you do. And also take advice. Be open. Be very open. Don't think you know everything. Because if someone's done it, chances are they've already failed before and they're doing it right now. So it would definitely be to be open, be open-minded, take advice. Um, but also ask a lot of questions. Interesting. Be cure, be very curious always. Interesting. So, Victoria, we wish you the best uh, with your project, and uh, I really enjoyed this conversation. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, and um, yeah, be this, uh, and I love listening to your show, and I hope I'm helpful. Great, great, great. Gracias, Victoria. You can find more about Victoria and Leslie at luxebeautyclub.com Thanks so much for listening to our show this week. If you want to find out more about our podcast, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at Comoloiso or visit our website at comoloiso.com Please subscribe to our show on Apple Podcast or anywhere you listen to your podcast. If you want to reach out to comment or suggest a topic, please email Hello, comoloiso.com. This show was produced at the iHeart Studios in Los Angeles. I'd like to thank our producer, Amelia Machiavello, our sound engineer, Martin Garcia, our technical supervisor, Nathan Staton, and Annie Sidervich, our general producer. Como Lo Hizo is a co-production from Premier Radio Network and Crece Grow Media. I am Fernando Schiantarelli. Thanks again for listening.